Hi, I'm Tenoch with Salute America, and on today's episode of Salute Explains, we're discussing the millions of immigrants and their families who were left out of the recent COVID-19 Relief Act. Just a few weeks ago, Congress passed the CARES Act, offering $2 trillion in relief to American citizens and businesses. The act was an effort to jumpstart the economy after coronavirus locked families down at home. But for undocumented immigrants who pay taxes using a taxpayer identification number, the bill provided them with nothing. And the children in that household, whether they were citizens or not, received no aid from the government either. A writer at America's Voice noted that immigrants paid $405 billion in U.S. taxes in 2017, including $27 billion from undocumented immigrants. This challenges the common belief that undocumented immigrants contribute nothing to the American economy and that they use national resources without ever paying. Latinos make up over 7 of the 11 million undocumented immigrants in the United States. They're often working on the front lines, risking COVID-19 exposure for a paycheck, and now they aren't getting any government support either. As lawmakers draft the next set of relief legislation, organizations like the League of United Latin American Citizens are calling on Congress to include help for immigrants this time around. Some of the things LULAC is urging Congress to provide include free coronavirus testing for all Americans, regardless of their citizen status, monthly cash transfers to families with children and at the lowest income levels, Guaranteed child care expense coverage for all essential workers who have to keep working throughout the pandemic and to end restrictions on providing health care to immigrants during a global health crisis. With states reopening across the country and many people going back to work, the majority of the burden will fall on Latinos and other people of color. And with no protections being extended to taxpaying immigrants, many of them are left still paying taxes for resources that they're not allowed to use. Thanks for watching this episode of Salute Explains. Find out more about different efforts to include Latinos in COVID-19 relief at salud.to slash immigrant coronavirus.